Hey guys, and welcome to this video on proofs. So in this video, we want to prove that an even number times an odd number is equal to an even number. And in the yellow rectangle here, I have the definitions for both an even number and an odd number. So let's start with the definition of an even number. Um, an even number is an integer that gives a remainder of zero when it's divided by two. And an example of this is two times n, where n is some arbitrary um, integer value. So this means that if we take two times n and we divide it by two, we're gonna always get a remainder of zero, all right? No matter what uh, the value of n is. Next, we have the definition of what it means for a number to be odd. And an odd number is an integer that gives a remainder of one when it's divided by two. So an example of this would be two times m, where m is some arbitrary uh, integer value plus or minus one, all right? So that means that when we have two times m plus one and we divide it by two, we get a remainder of one. And it also means that if we take two times m minus one and divide it by two, then we get a remainder of one as well. So let's go ahead and get started on this. The thing we wanna do is we want to multiply an even number. So I'm gonna use just even here uh, to, to represent our even number and we want to multiply it by an odd number. I was gonna say odd for our odd number. And we want to know, does it equal an even number? Okay, so let's use the definitions that we have um, to kind of prove this to be true. So an even number, we said it's just two times in and then we want to multiply that by an odd number and an odd number we said is two times m plus one or two times m minus one so we're going to do two m plus one and we want to know if it equals some even number so some even number would be something like two times k where k is some uh, arbitrary uh, integer value all right okay so I'm gonna go ahead and erase this 2K for now, but that's the answer that we want. So let's multiply out the left-hand side and hopefully we can get to that two times K on the right-hand side. All right, so 2N times 2M plus one is equal to um, two, and let's see, I'm just gonna rewrite it again, times 2M plus one is equal to uh, four, times n times m plus two times n. And what we can do is we can uh, factor out that two or a two and we get two times n times uh, m plus n, okay? And now if we let two times n times m plus n equals some arbitrary number. So we'll call it k, some arbitrary integer number. Then we get our equation two times k. We get our answer two times k, which is what we wanted. All right. So that's basically it, guys. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video. Please leave any questions you have in the comment section. Don't forget to hit that like button and that subscribe button. And if you found this video helpful, please share it. And as always, guys, thank you for watching, and I'll see you all in the next video.